Hey, what's going on guys? It's me Jared. Welcome back to yet another Minecraft video guys. So hey guys, I'll be showing you guys all the Education Edition. Uh, this is Minecraft Bedrock version 14.0. This is, uh, I've been working on this project for about like three weeks. And this is all the Education stuff. I have a bunch of stuff here. And I'll be showing you how everything works. Because, you know, I may or may not have had to use a YouTube tutorial or two for this. Um, but yeah, so basically this block right here could make special items with elements. So if I have some stuff here, so you could just do it yourself. So NACL, that's salt. Any smart person knows that. But there's some other ones where it's like carbon and hydrogen. Like, uh, if I take a carbon and a hydrogen, it makes nothing. So you have to have exactly 20 car hydrogen and exactly 9 carbon. Then you get crude oil. And I'm going to put that back in my chest dough. And there's iron and sulfur which gives you iron sulfate. 6 carbon and 6 hydrogen give you benzene. 8 carbon and 8 and 7 hydrogen and 3 nitrogen and 2 oxygen give you potassium chloride. 3 hydrogen, 1 nitrogen give you ammonia. There's more. H2O, uh, water, of course. Two oxygen, one sodium, two carbon, and three hydrogen give you sodium acetate. Two hydrogen, two oxygen give you hydrogen peroxide. Calcium and chlorine give you calcium chloride. Potassium and chlorine give you potassium chloride. Calcium chloride and potassium chloride. 5 carbon and 8 hydrogen give you latex. Latex is important over here because you use that to make balloons. Then you just take some helium and blah, blah, blah. Okay, so that's what this block does. You combine stuff and then you can make uh, stuff to make other stuff with these blocks. Now, uh, this block is pretty simple. In this block, you can see which atoms are in a specific element. Example, hydrogen. So if I take this this good old hydrogen right here, I can put it in here, and I could be like, all right, so I could see how many atoms are in it, like positives, negatives, and then neutrons. I could see how much stuff's in it. Pretty self-explanatory, easy, you know. Uh, next we have this. This helps you. This is a block where you can combine elements to make special item with more special items. So like. If I take ammonia and I take phosphorus, I got the ammonia from uh, here, which is three hydrogen and one nitrogen. So if I take uh, ammonia and I take phosphorus, I get super fertilizer. So yeah, I'm not going to do it because I only have one of each. But you get this thing called super fertilizer. <sighs> Why am I so out of breath? If you take salt, iron, charcoal, and water, you get a heat block. So, iron and salt. So, salt is Na plus Cl, which is uh, sodium and uh, chlorine. And you got regular charcoal, H2 two hydrogen, one oxygen, which makes water. Iron you can get from the creative menu. And then you get heat block. Basically, what this heat block does, it's pretty cool design, but if you step on it, it's like a magma block in survival. Which is, uh, pretty neat over here. Now, this is one of my favorites. If you take four sodium acetate, which I think you can get here, which is two oxygen, one sodium, two carbon, and three hydrogen, you can get sodium acetate. Now, this ice, ice, ice ball thingy, this ice bomb over here, uh, look. So you can throw it at water, like if you throw it at land, it does nothing. But if you throw it at water, it makes little ice blocks, which is nice. I like it. One of the best things in uh, this education edition right here. Next, we have this, the material reducer. It's simple and sweet. Basically, you could take dirt, sands, or stone, and you could see all the materials inside. So if you put it in there, you can get to see all this. Sands. There is silicon, oxygen, and o ox oxygen. Ox oh, there's more oxygen. Okay. And then you can take stone, and then there is silicon, oxygen, and more oxygen. Same as uh, sand. 
it's just a harder material and um, yeah so that's the first part of how to even use those four blocks next we're gonna go on to some special crafting recipes that you should really know because they could really help you in survival or just for fun in general so um, yeah be right back guys alright guys I'm back so basically if you take some sodium and then put TNT right under it like in this crafting table form you get underwater TNT so I don't have fire spreads on right now but basically you can put it underwater and like, if you take regular TNT it it, it like doesn't blow up anything so if you blow this up it's literally that but it actually blows stuff up underwater uh next if you take some magnesium and you take a torch and put it under it you get underwater torches it makes a cool little effect so like if i place it down right here look it gives off some light if i go close to it, it makes a cool little effect it makes like a tnt sound but you know nothing happens um Next, if you take some, uh, 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 what's, I, I don't know the name, uh, potassium chloride, if you take some of that, which you get from potassium and chlorine, uh, you, and you put some magnesium right under that, and then a stick, you get a sparkler. It looks different, because that's a used one. This, this, it's, it's a, it's glitched a little bit, so if I eat it, it's a little sparkler, and if I go into F5 mode over here, it's a little, it's a little sparkler, you know? It's pretty, pretty neat. And then next, guys. The thing you guys have been waiting for is balloon. Like I said in the beginning, it's six latex, three on both sides, a lead at the bottom, helium, and any dye of choice. I made a red balloon. You can make, like, a blue balloon, a red balloon. And then you'll get a balloon. You can put it on fences, or if I get a pig... You can put it down right here, spawn pig, and then bye bye pig, no one loves you. And uh, it's actually quite simple, bye bye pig. Alright, <laughs> well, um, by the way guys, if you want this in your world, all you need to do in Bedrock is put this setting on called Education Edition. Keep in mind, once you turn it on, you cannot turn it back off. It's stuck to your world. But it, it's, this is most like better on high-end devices not like Android tablets or phones in general like stuff like computers PlayStations Xboxes PCs stuff like that but if you guys enjoyed this video make sure you hit that like button down below you know if you guys hit that like button it turns blue and if you hit that subscribe button it turns gray you see it's only for my channel though if you hit those buttons they turn colors it's for no one else though and you should also check out one of my other videos and yeah if you uh want to join my discord server it's cloudy hashtag seven nine four eight uh talk to you later guys bye